right, so I'm on my way home from work and I decided to do short stories with Chris. So for today's short story, I'm gonna talk about the time that I found duty in our washing machine. So I found a bunch of poop in my washing machine when I lived in a frat, a frat house. It was, uh, I wasn't a member of the fraternity. I just lived in the frat house. I didn't even go to that college. Like I went to a community college at this point in time. I went to that college um, prior to this, but I moved in the frat house as a uh, student at a community college when I was working on my nursing degree. Anyways, we had two washers at this frat house because it was, it was a big house. It had a lot of people in it. And so, one day after work, I had gotten off work and decided I was going to wash me a load of clothes. And uh, on my way to the washing machine, I noticed that the lid was up. Okay, no biggie. And we had this old, like, we had one that was kind of new, and we had this old washing machine look like it was from the 80s. It was the old Sears and Roebuck. It was a black, uh, like, digital dash sort of washing machine so what had happened was somebody had opened the top of this washer and then pottied in it and had, to make it worse the bottom of it was full of water so it looked like somebody had turned on the load to like wash some clothes all of a sudden didn't realize they wanted to wash any clothes anymore so they just lifted up the lid and you know went where they went so <clears throat> i was the first one down there after the incident had happened and uh of course there's i see what i see and uh decided i was gonna figure out how to get this out of there so i had to let the washer actually finish its cycle i then took some bleach poured some bleach in the drum of that thing and run I think about three more times before I would put anything in that washing machine cause not every day you find poop in a washing machine but lo and behold when you live in a frat house even if you're not a what are you brother I think that's what you are even if you're not a member of the house you may find some crazy stuff in the washing machines. I never did find anything in the dryer that was crazy. But definitely that washing machine got, got my attention that one day. Well, that's my short story for the day. I'll try to have another one tomorrow. Thank you. Bye.